Good Monday morning, Kill Intermediate School. Morning. I am here with my awesome O&M friend, Larry, who has been doing an outstanding job with his staff, keeping our schools clean and preparing them for the fall. And on to our morning announcements. Good morning, KISS. Mr. Morrill, seventh grade science teacher here. I am out at Old Furnace State Park. It is Thursday afternoon, about 85 degrees, and I came out for a hike. Never been to this park before, lived in this area 20 years, and I've heard a lot about it. So I'm gonna do about a 2.8 mile hike and explore and see what we can find. Hiking uphill, and one of the treats about hiking this time of year is finding mountain laurel. Uh, just came across a patch, a uh, pretty big patch, and uh, the mountain laurel is just starting to come into bloom. And it is a gorgeous plant um, when it's fully in bloom. So, done a little bit of climbing, and I would guess we're up about 200 feet above a pond down below. So, came down the hill now. I'm on the pond that I um, shot from above, and I was shooting that from way up here right on the top of the bluffs. This is a man-made pond. This area was actually um, at the turn of the 1900s used for a uh, iron mill production. So there were uh, ponds created to power turbines that were run by water. This was a fairly well-known um, iron mill area. Another view of that pond and you could see this is the uh, man-made dam, and these ponds are connected by actually a really pretty small stream. When you're hiking, if you ever get turned around or get lost, one of the things they say is follow the water. Lots of markers on the trails here, so pretty difficult to get lost at Old Furnace State Park. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.